Hey everyone, how's it going? Breezy Ammer, welcome to Post Hello. Let's go deliver the mail and interact with some people. Apparently this game is played with the mouse only, so I have to... Oh damn, don't change the freaking alarm clock. Okay, I gotta um, go out of bed and turn off the <laughs> alarm clock. Okay, brush our teeth. Yeah, mouse only, so let me see. Alright, I think I'm, I'm brushing the side of my face. Of course, when you're half asleep, you don't know what you're brushing. Am I even using the toothbrush? What if I'm not even using toothpaste? I don't know what I'm using, but... Oh. Spit? I don't know. Okay, yeah, all right. Oh, I am my clothes. Whoa, okay, I'm ironing some... Whoa, I'm going right through the table. Wait, oh, <laughs> look at my face. Wait, oh, okay. Cereal. Yum. Nice. Mmm. Yum. Must. Consume. More. Sugar. Sure. Or just have a bowl of sugar there. Oh. Here we go. I have to deliver the mail. Oh. Oh. Well, here we are, our last stop of the day. Let's see what we have left in the trunk. I'll click here to move. All right. Oh, left click to move here. All right. Sweet, just one left. All right. Well, pick that bad boy up. Oh, yep. That's a hefty one. All right. Let's get you delivered. Oh, where are we going to go? Uh, here. Let's go here for. Oops. Oh, yeah. Go over here. I don't see too many houses, though. That's great. The store is open. That door's not open. I don't know. Let's go over here. What the? Who in the name of the good Lord are you? Why are you in my house? Uh, justify yourself. Sir, I was just just trespassing. Just infringing upon my private property, you were. I'm really sorry about that. Excuse me, sir. That, that didn't go over well. Must be the <laughs> must be the wrong house. Oh yeah, it's good. I don't know why I'm laughing so hard. Oh yeah, it's go over here. Here, no, don't walk into the wall here. Oh, yeah. Okay, you can stop now. Delivery. Uh, is your mother home? Um, hello, is your mother home? Uh, no, but I believe that package is addressed to me. Um, aren't you rather young to be home alone? Back when I was around your age, I'd be too afraid to open the front door when my parents never judge a book by its cover, sir. All of you know, I manage things around here. Okay. Um, don't you have, oh. don't you have class to attend? I believe most kids are around about this time of day. Frankly, I've had it with the public education system. I prefer to ruminate at home anyways. <laughs> Dang. Um, I see. School was quite some time ago for me. and definitely had its ups and downs. I suppose this pace isn't suited for everyone. Yeah. Hey, don't you have a job to do? Here, let me sign for the package. <laughs> Alright, Perla, could I have a signature? Yeah, sure. Have a great day. Thanks, you too. Alright, uh, okay, <laughs> yeah, just drop it right there. And <laughs> hey, aren't you gonna take your package? I mean, fine, leave it there. Oh, here, go home. Alright. Hey. Love my strut. I got my strut stuff going on here. <laughs> Come on, come on. Hey, close the back door. You gonna? Oh, okay, there's nothing in there, so. Okay. Damn, I'm so excited. Oh, I'm so tired. Damn, I can't even see the bed. <laughs> That's how I feel a lot. That's how I feel a lot of times when I go to bed. Plop down, no, not again. We can alarm clock. Throw it out the window. Oh, come on, really? <laughs> I can't get up. <laughs> oh damn. 
Okay, here we go again. Do 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 do. Iron, iron, iron. Okay, bowl. There we go. I'm so tired. When will catch a break? Never catch a break. Okay, let's hope uh, day two is better than day one, or as good as day one, I guess. Depends on how you look at it. You, delivery guy, hello. Oh, the grill. I remember you. You delivered a package of mine not long ago. Oh, right, Perla. Was it? Uh, how are you? Frankly, terrible. I'm quite glad you're here. I need your help. Okay, so earlier this morning I was testing out my geometry project and everything was going great until a sudden gust of wind. Wind? Yes, as I was saying, my project flew straight into my neighbor's backyard. Uh oh. Tell me more. Oh. Um, I had to build this kite with dowel rods and stuff. I put a lot of time into integrating and radiating on that thing. Anyways, I really need to get it back. Okay, go talk to the neighbor. He looks like he's home. Perhaps you could just talk to him? Um, I can. Why not? Well, despite having been neighbors since we moved here, my family never interacts with him. We're a little in the dark about who... Or I was hoping you'd be able to somehow get my kite back for me? Uh, okay, I'll see what I can do. Alright. Yeah, so she was telling me about her, her project there. Yeah, her geometry, whatever. Okay, it flew into his own brother. The grumpy old man, huh? Well, let's try. Oh, no. <laughs> how far back my arm goes. Damn. <laughs> Look at your nose, man. It's all red. Oh, here. Hello, excuse me, sir. Oh, man. What do you want? Well, um... I really don't mean to bother, but I, uh, need to grab something from your backyard. On my property without permission again, eh? What? No, it's not like that. It's the, your neighbor, the little girl next door, she... Well, I guess I'll just let Perlin know it didn't go so well. Oh, okay, I guess, um, he's not gonna let me get her kite, okay. Oh, Perla. Here. Oh. Hey, so. Um. I. I tried, but. Yeah. I see. I'm not at all surprised. She's really not one to take visitors. No kidding. There must be some other way. Oh. Well, I won't keep you here all day. Thanks for your time. Please let me know if you manage to achieve it, though. How am I going to retrieve it? Uh oh, you don't look so good. What? Are you alright? You! I'm fine. Uh, uh, you don't look at all that fine to me. I've fallen and I can't get up. Body, uh, ain't what it used to be. Um, I, I could try, I guess I could take you in the van to the hospital, I mean. I think you should get checked up for peace of mind. I really appreciate that. All right. Well, I did a good deed on day two, despite the grumpy old man. Oh, I gotta get out of bed. Okay, here. Come on. <laughs> Why does it take me like ten minutes to get to the? Oh, really? What the hell? Where's my? Come on. <laughs> Come on. Look at my eyebrows, like jumping off my head. Look at that. They're... 
<laughs> huh. You sexy dude, you. Okay, here we go. What, what's on my knees? I don't know. Oh, yeah, here we go. Oh, yeah. There you go. Yep. Yeah. There must be more to life than just work. I want connection. Yeah, I understand, my buddy. I understand. Must be more light life than work, huh? Work, sleep, work, sleep. Okay. I got a package here? Am I supposed to? Oh, okay, here we go. Let's go over here. Maybe this belongs to him now. Hope he doesn't throw something at me. Delivery! Hey, um, seems like I missed a package for you yesterday. Oh, that's alright. Um, how are you, you know? So, how are you feeling? Feeling fine, actually. Just gotta be more careful around the tile floors. Hey, really appreciated the help yesterday. It was nothing, really. It just felt like the right thing to do. Haha. -ha. You're one of the good ones. Not a lot of them like you out there these days. Um, what do you mean by that? Most people won't bat an eye to care about anyone but themselves these days, I tell you. Um, I don't know about that. I think there's plenty of good people around. You should just talk to them. Man, I was a real extrovert back in the day. Did law for my boys. Wasted efforts. All oh, that's going to get you. And what makes you say that? I'm saying, why should I even bother when my own kids don't bother to visit anymore? And two boys just took off, didn't even show up to their mother's funeral. I'm not reasoning with young people. Where's the respect? I'm really sorry. Sorry to hear that, sir. It's alright, kid. I got no expectations no more. I mean, you've got to try at least. I can't expect every delivery I make to be easy. But that doesn't mean I'll just quit, you know. Sometimes good stuff's unexpected, like yesterday. You just have to be open to, to it in the first place. Well, um, I'll just get going then. Wait, one more thing. Pick this out of the tree yesterday. Hey, you got Perla's kite for her geometry project. Cool. Let's go surprise her with her kite. You're gonna be so excited, isn't she? What a pleasant surprise! Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you so much! Oh, you're welcome! It's been quite some time since I've made a new friend, you know. Um, I'm glad. Oh, I see, well, I'm super happy to be a friend. Thanks, I really appreciate that. Personally, I've always had some difficulty connecting with the kids my age. Perhaps you'd understand? Um, um, school's a way back for me, but I think I might get it. Uh, I'm glad you might relate. I'm not sure what it was like for you, but I feel as though my interests go in line with those of my peers. I try my best to fit in, but at the, at the end of the day, I can't help that I care about well, what you care about. Um, I enjoy my studies, and I think about the world a lot. I care about learning. I care about my family. Hey, Perla, I'm sure you know, but you're really mature for your age. I do hear that a lot. I just feel so much misunderstood at times, and I'm not sure who actually cares. I feel quite judged sometimes for so the books I read, the clothes I wear, I can't connect with my peers, and even most adults won't take me. That sounds rough. <clears throat> but hey, I think it's fine to care about your own things. In fact, at my age, a lot of people still aren't sure what matters to them. So does everyone just go about feeling lost and all? Uh, no, not really. Sometimes it's hard. It's not like we always choose what to care about. But it's always good to keep learning. Anyways, our differences don't mean we can't still connect with others. You just, you just have to be open to it. Look at us. Hmm, I guess I'm quick to assume the worst at times. Hey, what do you believe you really care about? Well, 
Oh, my parents are back. I didn't mean to go on this tangent, but it was really nice talking. I think I'll think some more about what you said. Feel free to drop by whenever. Don't be a stranger. I have to go back to work. Have a good one. Yeah, I, I can relate to her. Maybe you can too in school. Always by myself. Never felt like I fit in. Wore these really big glasses as a six, seven year old. Got teased for it. Um, they always kept to myself and, uh, you know, anyway. Is this a therapy session? Maybe it is. Oh. What's he got? For this birthday. Oh, she invited him to the birthday party. Thank you for sparking our friendship with your kindness. Sincerely happy next door neighbor. Oh, that's sweet. <laughs> Wow! Oh, that was a that was a sweet story. Very nicely done, the creators. Nicely written, nicely the art and everything. Wow, oh, wow! That's such a nice message, isn't it? Be nice to people. Don't be afraid to spark a conversation with somebody. All the good stuff. Just be a nice person, okay? Be a nice person in spite of what someone else might be doing and you'll find life is going to be a little more pleasant so that's gonna do it everyone thanks for watching hope you enjoyed it and uh, yeah i'll see you soon for the next video bye